Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I know this video is a little delayed. I should have got it up like three, four days ago, but I was just really, really busy. Um, I've had some, not necessarily emergencies, but things I have to take care of. And it's been a little crazy. You guys know if you've been sticking around with me for a little while that I started school and I'm working full time. So I'm juggling a lot, but I did not forget you guys. I have two hauls for you guys today well two videos two separate hauls um so i'm gonna start off with my cvs haul i did do this haul on sunday it's not very big um there is a few things that were not in stock at my store so i'm going to do back to going back to do a part two to this haul but i got pretty much everything that i wanted it's just that i wanted um some more arm and hammer detergent i was going to get the packs and the liquid but they only had the liquid so I think I'm gonna go back for that and there might be like one or two extra items that um, I forgot to pick up but if I do do a big enough haul for me to film for you guys I'll put that up but if not I might just post it to my Facebook page or something like that so I'm gonna go ahead and get started I've already mentioned like I said I got the Arm & Hammer detergent I picked up two because I printed out one of the dollar off coupons for this one and I got a CRT which a lot of you got. Um, some of you might not have but it was a good majority of us that did get the $2 off Arm & Hammer detergent or $2 off laundry detergent um, CRT. So this one became free with no coupons needed and this one was $0.98. Cents. So I paid $0.98 cents for the both of them which was a really good deal. and. Um, the one that I recommend you guys get is the one, the free and clear, because it's, it's usually just a better detergent in my opinion, but, um, pretty much all the free and clears that CVS stocks at most stores have 25% more. So this one actually has 50 fluid ounces. So you get a little bit more. It may not make a huge difference to some people, but I just think that's cooler that you get more bang for your buck. And this is a favorite in my household. This is probably going to be gone uh, in, in about two months or so. So that's a good thing that I got it now. The next thing that I got was the Maxwell House coffee. Now this is $2.79 this week. Let me double check. Yeah, $2.79. And I had a $1.50 off um, coffee and tea purchase coupon. So I paid about a dollar for this. Now that, that could have been like $0.25 cents had I used the um, insert coupon that we had, but I forgot. So you guys can get this for cheaper. I couldn't, but it's not a big deal because we're all coffee drinkers in the house. Mine is hubby. So it's, it's still a good product. It's still going to be good put to good use and the normal price on this is like seven bucks so I still saved in the long run and I'm perfectly fine um, with what I paid for this guy and then I just have a few more things this one again too I paid for this but this is something that I really do enjoy and I'm going to eat so I've never seen this brand before but it's called um, crunchies freeze-dried strawberry and banana so basically it's dried fruit there's not a lot in here I will say it's supposed to be 1.2 ounces so I guess it's not meant to be a lot but I'll just put that out there right now it's, it's a little pricey but I had a CRT that I wanted to use it was $1.25 off of um, dried fruit and like canned fruit and this was on clearance 50% off for like 215 or something like that I don't remember the exact price I know I paid about a dollar for this so you guys might not want to do this if you have that same CRT but because I eat this and I liked it I got it and it was cheaper than buying like the CVS brand of dried fruit so I just picked this up and then the next grocery or the last grocery item that I got was this um, cup of noodles so I had a dollar off um, soup CRT that was expiring on Sunday and I actually didn't think to grab this because I recently got a dollar off soup like last week or two weeks ago and I didn't use it so I went ahead and tried this because it does say soup right here so you're not like breaking any rule it's soup it's it's a noodle soup and I even asked the cashier and it was not a problem the register 
automatically prompted her to give me the dollar off. It did auto adjust to 99 cents, so you're not going to get any overage from this, which is not a big deal. I mean, it's just a freebie. But just so that you guys know, um, so this one's 99 cents. I just got it for free. Hubby will eat this, so I'm really happy that this was for free and it was pretty cool. And then the last deal that I did was the all made deal. Now, if you guys have not done this and you're watching my video now, this deal is expired. The coupon expired on Sunday. Um, but I did this deal twice. I could have done the deal, what was it, eight or nine times, or the, the limit was six. So I could have done it six times because I had enough coupons. But um, my CVS was just having an issue with the coupon. Um, not that they weren't taking it, it's just they had to manually enter it and I didn't really feel like sitting there and having her manually enter it. Um, I actually didn't even know she was going to take my coupon because the last cashier um, had to reject it. So I didn't want to deal with the hassle of it. So it's still not a big deal though. I got a really good deal on some makeup that I'm going to use. So I'm actually missing one item. Let me see... Hmm. Oh, here it is. Okay. So, like I said, I did the deal twice. I'm missing one mascara because I gave it to my mom already. So, I got two of the Alme One Coat Mascaras. There's a blue one. There's a purple one. There's like a green one. Um, it doesn't matter which one you get. They're all the same. I think there's only one that's like a few cents more expensive, but it'll still work. So, I picked up two of these. And I also picked up two of these. Now you can get the Alme Softies um, if you want to to make this deal like super super cheap. However, I had CRTs that played in my favor so I wasn't mad about doing this deal and I wanted to try these. So these are the um, Alme Color and Care Liquid Lip Balm. So they're not like liquid lipsticks. They're not supposed to be like matte or long lasting or anything like that but it's just something nice to um, have on so this one is called just plum and it's like this really dark wine red color and I'm really happy with this one and then this one is called blooming yeah blooming so it's just a baby pink these are the only ones that they had left that weren't like super shimmery and I didn't really want shimmer so for these two these were priced at $6.29 and then this was priced for $8.49 I believe now, um, like I said, my cashier had to manually enter the coupon, so she manually entered the A49, so I automatically just got both of these for free. And then for these, I had a $4 off of 10 All May CRT that I got, and then everybody got a $4 off of All May coupon. So I used both of those, which gave me an additional $8 off. So that brought my total down to, what was that? Um... Like four dollars yeah so I paid four dollars for two of these and then two of these but I got back a four dollar extra buck so it made them all free so in case you guys are confused let me just go through that one more time I know it's a little weird I know you guys still can't do it anyway but just so that you understand how that works in case you might have had an issue with it or in case another coupon like this comes around I gave her two of the buy one Alme one coat mascaras or I'm sorry buy any one Alme product and you get a free mascara so these were my two Alme products I got two of these for free then I had two four dollar off um, Alme CRTs they both went through fine um, it's even on my receipt it says four dollars off Alme and then four dollars off ten Alme and I did spend over ten dollars so the CRT went through with no problems so for all four items, I'm missing one, like I said, um, I paid $4 and then got back $4, so it was free. So I was really happy with this. Now, for my total out of pocket, I did roll $10 in extra bucks. So I paid $0.22 cents out of pocket after my extra bucks, and then I got a $8 extra buck back. So this trip did cost me like two-ish bucks, but like I said, guys, I forgot my coupon for this one so I did pay for this and then I chose to do this deal even though it wasn't free so I'm still really really happy with this haul I mean two bucks for everything and it did include two detergents I think that's really really good so that was my haul you guys like I said it's not super big but 
Um, I did get stuff that I am going to use and I'm happy with. So, yeah. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you are not subscribed yet, make sure you're subscribed down below so you don't miss my videos. I know my video schedule is a little bit off. I don't always post on the same days, like always on Sundays, always on Mondays. It just kind of depends. But I try to get you guys like two to three videos a week. So if you have recommendations or you have something that you want to see, please let me know down below. I also do have my Facebook page that I try to update as much as possible. Um, so you can follow there too if you want to get in touch with me or just see more of me. And yeah, that's everything that I have for you guys today. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having a great day or evening or whenever you're watching this. And I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.